Hello. Today I'm going to talk about different types of print media. I'm going to talk about aluminum prints, canvas prints, as well as three different paper prints. I'm going to talk about the Canon Pro Luster paper, Hanamiel Fine Arboreta Satin paper, and the Hanamiel Photo Rag 308 Smooth paper. We're going to look at different samples of prints and how they can compare and contrast to each other and I'm going to show you examples of, of, of each so you can get an idea of what you're ordering when you look at the different options in my web store. So let's begin. This is a metal, this is an aluminum print. It is printed on aluminum. It is a thick grade aluminum so you cannot cut yourself. The corners are rounded. It is very reflective though. As you can see, you can see the camera in the in the print, but the colors are very vibrant. The blacks are very dark. It's very smooth finish. It looks really good on the wall. It's mounted with a float mount. It stands up off the print about half an inch. And then there's a place for a screw. You put the screw in the wall and then you put it into the screw slot. I like this type of print. It looks very futuristic and very sleek and very modern. It's just got great colors and it's just gorgeous. This is a canvas print. See the colors are vivid. Blacks are fairly black. It does have a slight sheen to it. But it's not reflective. It just is a little bit of a sheen to it. This type of canvas has a one and a half inch one and a half inch depth and it is backed so it actually is it's fairly solid you can squeeze it it's not going to damage it but it's not invincible so do treat it carefully it comes with a a hanging hook for for mounting on the wall with a nail Again, that's a canvas print. First up on the papers, we have the Hanamule Photo Rag Smooth 308. As you can see, deep blacks, rich colors, no glare whatsoever. It's a completely matte paper. It's a nice thick paper, so if you're not planning on mounting, it is, it is a good choice. It's a very lovely paper and I really like it a lot. I really love the way the landscapes look on it. This is the Hanamule Fine Art Burrito Satin. As you can see, the blacks are just a touch blacker than on the matte paper, the photo rag. The colors are just a tad more vivid, but it's really not by much. They're both gorgeous papers, the Hanamules. This is a real thick paper as well. Again, if you're not planning on mounting or you're printing large, this is a good choice. This has a little bit of texture to it and a little bit of luster to it. Whereas the, the photo rag matte has none. This is a great choice for fine art photography. This is Canon Pro Luster. As you can see, it's got vivid colors, dark blacks. It's a nice paper. But you can see it's got a lot of glare a lot of reflectivity, a lot of texture because it's a luster paper. 
None of these things are necessarily problems, but they're something to be aware of. The matte finish paper and the satin papers have less reflectivity, so there's less to distract from the photograph itself. As you can see, it's a very thin paper. So if you are printing larger than like a 5x7, you may consider dry mounting, especially if you live in a humid environment or don't run the AC in, in the winter, I'm mean, sorry, in the summer. Uh, consider dry mounting your, your print. 5x7s are probably okay though. Here are all three photos next to each other. On the top we have the Canon Pro Luster, then we have the Hannah Mule Fine Art Burrito Satin, and finally the Photo Rag by Hannah Mule 308 Smooth Matte Paper. You can see the difference in the coloration. The matte paper is slightly less vivid, slightly less black on the blacks, but it is still a gorgeous choice. And without any reflectivity, it's going to actually show better in, in some situations. So this is all three next to each other. So I hope this helps seeing all three at the same time. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to email me or send me a message in my Etsy store. I'd be more than happy to help you figure out which, which type of artwork you're going to love. Thank you very much and I'll see you next time.